Hello friend, are you sure that you are really called to the ministry? Entering ministry is a serious thing that has eternal consequences and therefore we must examine ourselves and consider our calling sincerely and prayerfully before launching into ministry. So here are five ways to discern if you are called by God to ministry. Number one, desire. It's desire. You're going to want to do it. You gotta have the desire. It's like in First Timothy chapter three, verse one. It says that if a man desires the position of a bishop, he desires a good work. Just like in salvation, right? God will work in you, and He will give you the will and desire to do what He calls you to do. But not every desire and motive are. Uh, centered on God, right? If God calls you to ministry, He will give you the desire to do it. In fact, Spartan says, if you can do anything else, do it. If you can stay out of ministry, stay out of it. What he means is that if God calls you, you may try to run away from it, like Jonah in the Old Testament. But you cannot because of the desire to do it, right? And number two, it's gift. The Holy Spirit will give you power to do your gift. If God calls you to ministry and does not give you the power and the ability to fulfill it, it is impossible. His Spirit will empower you and give you the gifts you need to do ministry. And my question is, have you experienced the power of God while doing ministry? Number three, it's opportunity. God will give you the place and the time. If God calls you to ministry, He will give you the opportunity, like people and a place to exercise your gifts and minister to others in His time. So when the opportunity comes, take advantage of it or you may even have to search for it or make it but don't forget to prepare pray and fast while you wait on God number four it's testimony your local church will recognize this Christians are people of communion with God and his children in their local ecclesial community their local church as we live out our faith in our local church among our spiritual brothers and sisters they will be able to recognize your calling you they will be able to recognize your calling so get to know the people in your local church begin serving them and be encouraged to receive their encouragement and number five lastly it's the word of god you must study the Bible. You must study the Word of God. No one is fit for ministry until he knows or she knows the Bible. And he will not know it until he takes it seriously by reading and meditating on it daily, studying it, practicing it, and only then preaching and teaching it to others. You cannot teach others what you do not know for yourself and you cannot or rather you should not preach to others what you would not preach to yourself first so the word of God is the sword of the Spirit of God and so if a minister is not equipped with the word of God the Holy Spirit will not simply use him there they are. These are the five ways to discern your calling. Do you agree with these points? If not, why not? If so, are you called to ministry? Do you have any other points you would like to add? Please comment below. Until next time, bye-bye.